APD is giving us a better insight into what led up to an officer involved shooting that left a suicidal man injured last month. Today, police released the 911 call and lapel video. News 13's Jackie Kent is here with more. Kim, police were called to this apartment complex on August 19th when a caller told them a man armed with a gun was threatening to kill his neighbors. We do want to warn you, the lapel video is dramatic. That's the voice of APD officer Ian Ross yelling at 38 year old Joe Lambert to put down a rifle outside his apartment on Dallas Street. That's off Central in Louisiana. Police say for about two hours, Lambert kept walking in and out of his apartment at times with a rifle in hand and telling officers to kill him. He reportedly ignored police commands to drop it. And it was when he pointed the barrel at officer Ian Ross, you see on your screen, that Ross fired three shots. One of the shots fired by Officer Ross struck the rifle Lambert was holding. But Lambert continued to walk into the parking lot of the complex and police say officers around the corner thought Lambert was firing at APD officers. So Officer Richard Witten shot two rounds, one of which also hit Lambert's rifle and ricocheted, hitting him in the groin. After Lambert was released from the hospital, he was booked into MDC for aggravated assault with a deadly weapon and two counts of assault on a peace officer. He has 10 prior arrests related to DWI cases, plus he has one case pending for aggravated burglary and battery. Kim, back to you. Okay, thanks, Jackie. Now, officers Ross and Witten have never been in an officer-involved shootings before this. APD says as part of department protocol, the Civilian Police Oversight Agency will investigate if they did follow proper procedure.